the final four teams in the 2023 UEFA Champions League field have completed the first leg of their S. Emmy final matchups, and with a berth in the final on the line, the second leg should be even more entertaining. Before we continue you are welcome to Wise BJ2 TV channel. Real Madrid and Manchester City played to a 1-1 draw in the first leg on Tuesday at Santiago Bernabeu Stadium, with Vinicius Jr. and Kevin De Bruyne tallying goals. Inter Milan defeated AC Milan 2-0 in the first leg of their semi-final matchup on Wednesday at San Siro Stadium, with Edin Zeko and Henrik Mkhitaryan each scoring. With the first leg of the semi-finals in the books, oddsmakers have adjusted the betting lines accordingly with just three matches remaining in this year's Champions League tournament. Current top scorers. 1. Erling Holland, Manchester City, 12. 2. Mohamed Salah, Liverpool, 8. T3. Kylian Mbappe, Paris Saint-Germain, 7. T3. Vinicius Jr., Real Madrid, 7. 5. Joao Mario, Benfica, 6. T6. Mehdi Terami, Porto, 5. T6. Rodrigo, Real Madrid, 5. T6. Rafa Silva, Benfica, 5. T6. Robert Lewandowski, Barcelona, 5. T6. Victor Ojvin, Napoli, 5. T6. Olivier Giroud, AC Milan, 5. When Vini Jr. opened the scoring in the first leg of Tuesday's match between Real Madrid and Manchester City in the 36th minute, doubt clouded the idea that the citizens could avenge their 2022 semi-final loss to Los Blancos. After a disappointing first half for Manchester City, the club came out with a strong second half that saw Kevin De Bruyne unleash a rocket from outside the penalty area to tie the match 1-1. It marked De Bruyne's 11th goal for Manchester City in the knockout stages of the UEFA Champions League, which is the most by any City player in the tournament's history according to ESPN Stats and Info. Although Manchester City and Real Madrid enter the second leg of the semi-finals on equal ground, the Sky Blues have the upper hand as the second match will be played at Etihad Stadium, their home field. Manchester City will be looking for Erling Holland, the Premier League's leading goal scorer, to rise to the challenge in the second leg and get the club into the Champions League final for the first time since 2021. Real Madrid will be aiming to win back-to-back -back Champions League titles in their sixth since 2014. Inter Milan, Meanwhile, defeated rival AC Milan 2-0 on Wednesday at San Siro Stadium, putting the club in a solid position entering the second leg of the semi-finals later this month. Inter came out quick in the first leg, with Edin Zeko scoring in the 8th minute and Henrik Mkhitaryan following it up with a goal of his own in the 11th minute to give the Nerazzurri a 2-0 lead and put AC Milan under pressure early. AC Milan was unable to recover from those two early goals and now face an uphill battle with the second leg coming later this month. The Rossoneri have not reached a Champions League final since 2007, when they defeated Premier League side Liverpool to claim the title. Inter Milan last reached the Champions League final in 2010, when they defeated Bundesliga side Bayern Munich to win the title. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and turn on your notification bell for more updated. God bless.